Welcome back to the Ruby Tuesday. I am talking about an AMC Plus new animated adult series that nobody is talking about because they have not marketed this series at all. Which is crazy because it has an all-star voice cast. If you saw these people walking down the street, your mouth would be ajar and you'd be like, look at all those famous people because the voice cast is incredible and the animation style is just awesome and the story is amazing. So I'm really confused as to why nobody is talking about this or why nobody is marketing it. Very few people have even reviewed this. So let me know if you've even heard of this. Have you seen any marketing for it? Let's jump in. The thrilling speculative drama is centered on a bullied teen, Maddie, who receives mysterious help from someone online. A stranger soon revealed to be a recently deceased father, David, whose consciousness has been uploaded to the cloud following an experimental destructive brain scan. David is the first of a new kind of being, an uploaded intelligence or UI, but he will not be the last as a global conspiracy unfolds that threatens to trigger a new kind of world war. This was a really fascinating, interesting story. I love it when animation tackles proper adult themes and, and I don't mean dodgy adult themes. I just means some animation series, even when they're meant to be for an older generation, treats that generation as if they're dumb. This one does not do that. This is a really interesting story. The animation itself, as I mentioned earlier, is really great to look at. It doesn't feel like they've they're cheap. It feels like they've had some budget and as I mentioned the voice cast but it's the story that excels here if you took the matrix and the Amazon series upload and you kind of molded those together and then got really deep with the theology and the themes that they're talking about then that's the type of series that you have here I've seen four of the eight um, so I'm hoping to catch the next four and of the four I'm totally sold although the first two is establishing the world and some people might teeter off and go, I'm a little bit bored of this. I guess I've seen some comments. People say that that's what has happened to them. For me, I was enthralled from the beginning because the mystery is there. They're building these the first UIs ever. And it comes up with that question. Should we be doing that? As always, humans like to tinker with things and not really understand the consequences of AI is a big thing at the moment in the world. UI will be a thing as well. The upload series on Amazon kind of goes into that a little bit, but not as much as you or was I, I was hoping. Here we delve a lot into that and the consequences of that. You can see it's all building to a crescendo that's obviously going to probably not be good for us. Anybody remember the Terminator films or Skynet? You know, it's that sort of feeling that is building up in this. But it does spend a lot of time with our new characters uh going from are they human or are they more than human and once they explore their boundaries and their worlds that they've been given or they are able to explore more than that then they start asking questions of what am i now and then it's the families on this on these sides you know we're exploring this relationship between maddie and her father and what is her father now and as the bad guys are I say they are bad guys, but there's just humans being humans as they experiment more and think they have control of these characters. That's obviously not going to be the case. So what we have then is a new species that could tear the world apart. But it really is down to character based storyline, seeing how they react. Now, the question comes, if we can upload, what happens when you download? That's an interesting one. Let me know in the comments below, have you seen anything of this? Have you checked it out yet? Have you seen the first two episodes? What do you think of those? I've loved the four episodes. I can't wait to watch the next four. I can't give up like a, a result of like what I think about the whole season yet because I haven't seen it, but it's definitely going to be one of my favorites, I think. If it manages to stick the landing and the mystery is there when it gets to the end, I think it could be one of my all time voice work, animation, all fantastic. Let me know what you think. What is your favorite animated series at the moment? Mine is probably Invincible or Vox McKenna. I liked really both of those. Thanks so much for watching, but most of all, until next time, remember, live long and Tuesday.